Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Hope and today I'm gonna be doing the part two to my jeans collection. You guys can see behind me, I have a lot of jeans. So I'm just gonna try to go through everything pretty quickly. So if you're interested, just keep watching. Also, I'm gonna be doing a jean giveaway once I hit 10K on Instagram. So I'll put my handle right here. So make sure to follow me if you guys want to be part of that giveaway. So the first three denim right here are all from Boohoo and the Boohoo denim are lightweight so they're pretty comfortable to wear and they don't have any stretch. First one that I have is this pair and this is on the darker wash side and this one is the only one that is the petite sizing so the length is perfect for me because I'm only 5'2". This one is a mom jean style and the back pockets are plain which I know a lot of you guys like. And then the bottom is a bra hem. I got a size US 1 in this and it fits perfectly and I'm usually a 24 in jeans. So the next one that I have from Boohoo is a black pair and this is also a mom style jean and the bottoms are just regular so it's not a raw hem. This is a regular length so it is a little long on me. The back pockets on all of them are plain. All of them are also high-waisted. And I got a US 2 in this one, so it is a bigger size than the first one that I showed you, the petite version, but it also fits pretty well. So the last one that I have from Boohoo is this light blue one, and it's a mom style jean as well, except this one has distressing on the knees, and then the bottoms are just regular, so no raw hem. And then the back pockets are plain as well, and it is high-waisted too. And the sizing for this one is a US 2 and it fits me pretty well. So the next store that I have is Adika and as you can see right here, I have a lot to show from Adika. And for sizing, I get an extra small on all of them. So the first one that I have from Adika is a pair of denim shorts and it has these little crystal, little bedazzled detailing in the front around the pockets and it's distressed as well. And then the back pockets are plain. Here on Adika denim, there's no stretch to any of them, so I would say if you're in between sizes, size up. And so this one has a button type of closure instead of the zipper. So the next one that I have from Adika is this light blue pair, and this is like a mom style jean or a straight style jean. As you can see, it has a little bit of distressing. In the back, there's a graphic that says Girl Squad, and there's a butt rip underneath the pocket. So this one is high-waisted and it's a zipper closure. So the next one I have is also another pair of denim shorts from Adika. It's the longer style denim shorts that are really popular right now, the Bermuda style. And this is a light blue pair and it has a zipper closure and it is high-waisted. And then it just has a raw hem right here. And then the back pockets are plain. So the next one that I have from Adika is another light wash pair. And this one has a lot of distressing around the knees. And then it also has a raw hem. This is probably one of my favorites from Adika. And then the back pocket is plain, except it has a little bit of distressing. And it is also high-waisted. So the next one from Adika is a black pair. And this one is really distressed, which you'll see in the try-on. It's completely open right here around the leg or the thigh area. And then the bottoms are just normal. They're not raw hem or anything like that. This has a button type of closure and it is high-waisted. For all Adika denim, if you're in between sizes, size up because they run pretty small, especially this one. So the next one from Adika is the fun pair that has this graphic on it and it has like a snake graphic on the upper thigh and towards the bottom of the other leg. Zipper closure and it is high-waisted. And then the back is completely plain. So the snakes are only on the front. The next one that I have is a gray wash and it's also a straight style denim and it has distressing on the knees. And this one has a zipper closure. This one from Adika is another black pair. It's almost like a washed black because it has a bit of a gray tint. And this one is a wide leg style at the bottom or like a baggy jean style it has rips on both knees. So this is one side and then rips on this side on the knee area. And then the back is completely plain. This one is the only one from Adika that runs pretty big. So if you're in between sizes, size down. So the last one that I have from Adika is my favorite pair of jeans from Adika. And it's the one that I showed on my TikTok that you guys all loved. 
and it's the Davis jeans. There's a lot of distressing all throughout the leg. The back is plain. So now I'm gonna move on to the jeans behind me. So the first pair that I have is from Girlfriend Denim and you can find these at Revolve and I believe Nordstrom. These aren't as high-waisted as my other jeans, but it's not low-waisted either. Back is just plain pockets and then it has a little um, patch that says Girlfriend. And then this one is really distressed all throughout. And so I cut this myself and I have a tutorial on TikTok on how I did that. So the next one that I have is a pair from American Eagle. And I talk about this type of jean on my TikTok all the time. And it's the American Eagle mom jean, but this one is in the cool classic color instead of the uber, uber cool, which I showed in my last jean collection video. So it's pretty much the same thing. It just has a different wash. I just cut the bottom so it's a raw hem. Usually in American Eagle, I get an extra short length, but I got a regular length in these. So that way I could have the extra length to cut. Next one that I have is not really a jean material. It's kind of like a cargo style jean or cargo style pant. And it's the Jane Cargos from Brandy Melville. And it's a off-white cream type of color. And I got a size, size small on this. This one has loops on the side of the jean and then pockets. And then the bottoms are just normal like that. This one is really high-waisted and it has a zipper closure. So the next one that I have is this one from Zara. And I showed you guys the blue color of this in my part one. And it's just the high-rise straight jean from Zara. And the bottom is a raw hem. And then the back pockets are plain, just like most of the Zara jeans. I get a size 25 in these, even though I'm in 24 waist, because Zara jeans run pretty small. So pretty much the rest of the ones behind me that I'm gonna show are all from Fashion Nova. So the first one that I have is this one right here. And this one is a really baggy style jean. And it's supposed to be a straight style jean based on the picture on the model, but on me, it looks more like baggy jeans. And I got a size one in this one and probably a size zero would have fit better. And then all of the Fashion Nova denim have plain pockets. The next one from Fashion Nova is this light blue colored, is this light wash jean. And this one has a lot of distressing all over the legs. And it has a zipper closure in the front and it is high-waisted as well. Size 24 in these and they fit me perfectly. The one that I have is also from Fashion Nova and this is just a plain um, mom style jeans so there's no rips on them and it's like a medium blue wash. Zipper closure on the front and it is high-waisted. And then the back is plain. Also, it is a raw hem. I got a size 24. So the next one that I have from Fashion Nova is this light blue color and this one is a mom, is the high rise mom style jean and I got a size one slash 25 in these. So I went up a size. So I also forgot to mention that none of the Fashion Nova jeans have any stretch. So just keep that in mind when picking out a size. So the next one that I have is a darker blue wash mom style jean and it's a little bit of distressing but the holes aren't that big so you can't see too much skin and then the bottoms are plain so it's not a raw hem and then the back pockets are just plain and this is also a zipper closure one from fashion nova is i believe the last one and it's just a black style and it is their mom jean i believe and i got it in a zero which is a waist 23 and this one fits me perfectly. And as you can see in the front, it has this detailing right here where it goes like that. So the next store that I have is Cotton On and are the dad style jean. And I have two to show of this style. And the first one is a black grayish wash and it's just a baggy style jean. And this one fits me perfectly and it's a size US2. So their sizing is pretty inconsistent because I get a two in all of them, but they all fit me differently. It's the same style as the one I just showed, the dad jeans. And this is the same size as the black one, which is a US two. But for some reason, this one runs big. So I don't really understand why the same jean in the same size doesn't fit the same. So if you get this color, make sure to size down. So the last one that I have from them is the long straight leg jean and i got it in a size us2 and this one fits me perfectly so the next place is gap and i have two jeans to show and they're both the mom jean from gap and i got a size 0 25 
in this light blue color. This is probably one of my favorite fits of all of my jeans that I have. So I highly recommend the mom jeans from Gap. I have another pair of the same jean from Gap and it's also the mom jean style. It's just a darker blue wash. This one I got in a double zero slash 24 and it also fits me. So the last one that I got is my newest pair and it's from Urban and it's their high rise baggy jean. I got them in a size 24 and it fits me perfectly except the length on them is a little too long so I'd probably get them fixed just because I don't want them to scrunch as much as they do. But it is super high-waisted and the back pockets are plain. So that's it for my jean collection. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Bye.